So Terrence Crawford and Sean Porter have 30 days from now to, I hope it ain't so damn echo, so much echo in here, but they have 30 days from now to come to a deal, otherwise it's gonna go to purse bid. But what I found, what I noticed, I found kind of strange is if it goes to purse bid, Crawford's, Crawford gets 60% of the purse bid. So to me, I, I was just thinking about that. Sean Porter definitely doesn't want to go to purse bid then obviously, right? Because he's, 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 only, he's only gonna get 40%. But what if like Bob and Bud try to somehow sabotage a deal just so we can go to purse bid so they can get 60? Cause I'm pretty sure Sean probably wants more than 40% at this point, which he should get more than 40%. I hope Crawford isn't somehow delusional. Let me back it up. First of all, I don't think Crawford's gonna take this fight. I really don't. I've been wrong before, face. <laughs> I'm wrong a lot. But I don't think they take this fight. I, I, just like I don't think, I didn't think, I thought T.O., well, that's, that's a whole different, that's a whole different, a whole different case. But uh, yeah, I don't think Bud's gonna take this fight, honestly. So I feel like that's gonna be, I don't want to digress too much on why it won't take this fight, but damn it. I don't want to get too far, too far off topic. I don't want this video to go too long, but I want to delve into why I don't think Buzz All right, let me summarize. Let me, let me do a Jim Carrey. I just don't think this is the right time for Bud to be taking this fight. I mean, I feel like he should have big fights like this, but I feel like somehow he doesn't, he doesn't think like, you know, this is just the proper time to be fighting Sean Porter. Cause I mean, rumors were he wasn't trying to fight short, she wasn't trying to fight Sean Porter not too long ago. So I feel like he, the, the, he's being forced to now, people people are saying he's being forced to now, like the the, the, the organization is just, the sanctioning body just did a complete 180 now trying to force his ass to fight Sean Porter. So I feel like just, you know, being kind of egotistical, people are, you know, like camps and shit and promotion. But I, I don't know, I just don't feel like, I, I don't feel like he's gonna wanna take this fight right now. You know what I mean? But anyways, <laughs> but so yeah, they would want, Terrence Crawford and Bob would want her to go to Purse Bid, you would think, they get 60%. Sean does not deserve 40%. I don't understand why why the sanctioning of bodies would just rule 60% in Terrence Crawford's favor. Sean Porter brings more stars out to the to the fights, doesn't he? I mean that's that's like a that's a thing, isn't it? He brings more stars out to the fight for one. Sean Porter has a better resume. He's like the full-fledged 147, although Terrence is at this point too now, but you know what I mean? But you know, I'm just saying, like he's always been like a, like a full-fledged welterweight. I just don't understand why 60-40 would be awarded if it goes to purse bid. You know, I can see maybe 55-45, you know what I mean? Because, I don't know, maybe accomplishments and shit, accolades, but definitely no 60-40. That's a big 20%, man. Hell no, man. That's craziness. That's craziness, man. But anyway. <laughs> so, so baby, basically in conclusion, I still don't understand though how they got how they got to that number. I'm hoping hey, somebody please let me know, or if somebody who has a channel sees this video somehow this may be a topic. <laughs> I'm a, I mean, I'm gonna go on the YPBC. That's what I'm gonna do. I think Mad Chat Box is going live right now. I'm gonna go hop on there and play, hey, man. Anybody, can anybody explain to me why the 60-40 is you know is acceptable, appropriate, designated to this fight? But um, anyways, thanks for rolling with the punches. See you on the next one. Bye.